got my heroes, and today I'm bringing you Five Nights at Freddy's 2. And, um, I just got interrupted. I was playing, but you know, family. Family first, am I right? Let's go ahead and get started. The audio files or call should not play because I was just in it. But if it does, I will be quiet. As huge. Let's see. Oh, it's coming. Okay. Uh, hello? Hello? Uh, see, I told you your first night wouldn't be a problem. You're a natural. Uh, by now I'm sure you've noticed the older models sitting in the back room. Uh, those are from the previous location, and we just use them for parts now. The idea at first was to repair them. Uh, they even started retrofitting them with some of the newer technology. They were just so ugly, you know, and the smell. Uh, uh, so the company decided to just go in a whole new direction and make them super kid-friendly. Uh, those older ones shouldn't be able to walk around, but if they do, the whole Freddy head trick should work on them too, so whatever. Uh, I love those old characters. Uh, did you ever see Foxy the Pirate? Oh wait, Foxy. Oh yeah, Foxy. Uh, hey listen. Uh, that one was always a bit twitchy. Uh, I'm not sure if the Freddy head trick will work on Foxy. Uh, if for some reason he activates during the night, and you see him standing at the far end of the hall, uh, just flash your light at him from time to time. Those older models would always get disoriented with bright light. Hey, it would cause a system restart or something. Uh, come to think of it, you might want to try that on any room where something undesirable might be. It might hold it in place for a few seconds. Uh, that glitch might carry it over to the newer models, too. Uh, one more thing. Don't forget the music box. I'll be honest. I never liked that puppet thing. It's always thinking that it can go anywhere. Uh, I don't think the Freddy mask will fool it. So just don't forget the music box. Um, anyway, I'm sure it won't be a problem. Uh, have a good night, and I'll talk to you tomorrow. Okay. Um, well, since 19 and I know I told you guys in the first episode that this got crazy for me. It's because of this bastard right here. He was always on this little right corner. That means he's going to attack. And so I had to use, like, every single time I came out of the camera. <laughs> no, little kid. No, I should probably wind that up. And one of them's about to come to the vent. You like chicken, bud? Me too. I know. I'm really happy about it. Oh, sun's in the hallway. Okay, really? I still can't do it. Oh, it's you. You're really fucked up. Do you know that? Like, it's like, like, he took too much crack and it, like, almost killed you. And you're barely surviving. Hi. <sighs> 3 a.m. So relatively other than body. I guess I'm safe. You want some more chicken? I don't have any. I have pizza. Want that? No? Okay. My pinky is going up.
Toy Freddy doesn't seem like he wants to attack. Well, that's a tr oh. We had it to the back, definitely. What did I tell you? What did I tell you? Yeah! Alright. Um. Okay, I'll do 93 as well. What's this? Oh. I'm looking around. Oh. Well, that's a pretty face. Why, what about you? Like you look like you wanna have lots of sex and I don't think I'm into that. I don't know if I'm into that because it's a robot. <laughs> uh, it's me. No, it's your mom! <laughs> I'm cool like that. Okay, well, night three. If I die, I'm only gonna take one attempt. <laughs> Cause I set a philosophy that one night equals one episode, and I'm breaking that philosophy. Like, right now. what's it called? Oh. Hello, hello. Think I told you you wouldn't have any problems? Did uh, Foxy ever repair the hallway? Yes, bitch. Probably not. I was just curious. Like no, I said, she, did. she was always my favorite. They tried to remake Foxy, you know? Uh, they thought the first one was too scary, so they redesigned it to be more kid-friendly and put it in Kid's Cove uh, to keep the toddlers entertained, you know? But kids these days just can't keep their hands to themselves. The staff literally had to put Foxy back together at the end of every ship. Eventually, they just stopped trying and left him as some kind of take-apart, put-back-together attraction. Now he's just a mess of parts. I think the employees refer to him as just the mangle. Uh, oh, hey, before I go, uh, I wanted to ease your mind about any rumors you might have heard lately. Uh, you know how these local stories come and go and seldom mean anything. I can personally assure you that whatever is going on out there, however tragic it may be, has nothing to do with our establishment. This all rumor and speculation, people trying to make a buzz, you know. Uh, our guard during the day has reported... Nothing oh! Oh! No, 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 no. It's both. Okay, well, anyway, hang in there and I'll talk with you tomorrow. Well, this is where I'm assuming it's, get, it's gonna get really crazy. Ah, he's probably in the vents. He's 
gonna be here soon. I can just tell. Force me out of that. Fuck me. 